Hello, I'm Michael Lin. I'm a neurosurgeon here at the Southeastern Neurosurgical and Spine Institute at the Greenville Hospital System. And I'm here to talk to you today about trigeminal neuralgia. Trigeminal neuralgia is a very interesting disease and it affects thousands of Americans every year. It's a disease where patients experience a sharp shooting pain in their face, either on the forehead or in the cheek or down in the chin or a combination of all of those areas. Uh, and uh, it is a pain that is um, short lasting but very, very severe. The characteristics of the disease uh, include uh, pain that is set off by a trigger. Sometimes it's brushing the teeth or chewing or even uh, cold water or wind on the face. And the pain lasts for several seconds to a minute and disappears, but it's very debilitating. When patients first present with these symptoms to their physician, oftentimes it is misdiagnosed. Uh, patients uh, can be told that they have uh, jaw pain or pain in their teeth and they see a dentist and uh, oftentimes they have uh, teeth pulled um, to try to relieve the pain. Obviously if that's not an origin to their pain, uh, it does not cure their problem. When trigeminal neuralgia is finally diagnosed, the main treatment is medication. Uh, carbamazepine or Tegretol uh, is a good medication that often is able to control the pain um, uh, to a good extent. However, many patients don't tolerate Tegretol or carbamazepine and the side effects become uh, uh, too much to bear. At that point, the patients will see a neurosurgeon. There are multiple procedures that can treat trigeminal neuralgia. Uh, trigeminal neuralgia is caused by pressure on the trigeminal nerve, which is the nerve that supplies sensation to the face. And the pressure on the nerve is often caused by a blood vessel uh, that forms a loop that causes compression on the nerve. We are able to treat trigeminal neuralgia in several ways. There is stereotactic radiosurgery. Uh, there is a procedure called radiofrequency ablation where the nerve can be heated and the pain can be stopped. However, this treatment is temporary. There is a procedure called microvascular decompression where a small incision is made behind the ear on the side of the pain and a small hole is made in the skull about the size of a quarter. We can then approach the nerve and find the vessel that is compressing the nerve and gently lift it off the nerve and insert a pad to protect the nerve from any further pressure or damage. This is a definitive treatment for trigeminal neuralgia and incredibly satisfying uh, for a surgeon to treat. If you have a patient or you have symptoms uh, of trigeminal neuralgia, please tell your primary care physician to refer you to a neurosurgeon for appropriate treatment.